stop using your high Kanashi indicator right now. Add this indicator instead and double your profits overnight. Thank you for clicking on this video. My name is Trades by Mo and welcome back to another video. It is a very clever strategy that only uses one indicator and you can use it to double your profits today. But let's not waste any more of your time. Please hit that subscribe button if you are new as always. Let's get straight into the strategy. Okay, so there is one indicator that we're going to add to our chart. We must first add one other thing to improve our chances of success even more. You see, with this strategy, we will only be focusing on one time frame during the day. We will be focusing on the New York session. So to do this, click on indicators at the top, type in sessions, and it's the sessions on chart. Add this indicator to your chart and then remove London, Tokyo and the Sydney sessions. We only want to keep New York on the chart as this red block is the only time we will be taking trades. The sessions indicator is definitely not needed. Say for example, if you have the free trading view and you can only use three indicators, then maybe you don't want the sessions indicator to take up one of those three important slots. Then feel free to tick off the sessions indicator. Simply draw boxes with the rectangle tool. But now that we've got rule one out of the way for trading in the New York session only, let's move on to the special indicator and show you the settings, exactly how to take trades, and then we'll move on to the results. While the older Heiken Ashi indicator is popular, it is also very messy. It's hard to determine true price with Heiken Ashi bars, and while this can be very helpful to use while trading, it can also be a challenge, especially when you're trying to enter and exit trades, and you don't want to be flicking between Heiken Ashi and candle bars all the time. So we're now going to add this indicator to our chart, and it is very, very powerful, I promise you, but make sure you watch exactly what I do now and follow all of the steps. Okay, so click on indicators at the top. Now to find this indicator, type in Smoothed Heikinashi and it is the Smoothed Heikinashi Sam X indicator by Sam Account X. But we're not just gonna add this once to our chart. In fact, we're going to add it twice and I'll show you why in a minute. But just before we do that, let me quickly tell you about Flux Charts and why they've sponsored today's video. Flux Charts has a massive range of insanely powerful indicators for any type of market. I have actually tested out a few of their indicators on the channel and I love them very much and most importantly have had very good success with them. I want you to join Flux Charts today because I want to see more traders break through the wall and Flux Charts might just be the key that you need to finally become a profitable trader and I really want you to succeed so you've got two options. Option one is to click the link below and try out the Flux Charts seven day completely risk free trial for yourself. Yes, completely risk free. And option two, Flux Charts were kind enough to give a 20% off code at checkout. So use code MO and you'll be making money back already. So don't wait any longer and take the leap and I will see you in the Discord making money. Let's get back to the video. You see, not only is the Heiken Ashi indicator for determining trend, but we can also double up the indicators to double up your profits. You can do this by using a multi time frame strategy while simultaneously only focusing on one time frame. We'll be trading on the five minute chart, so the first indicator we need to sort out is the smooth Heiken Ashi for the five minute time frame. Click on the settings for the first indicator. You can see we have the smoothing length set to five, show wicks is turned off. And the time frame for the Heiken Ashi candle calculation is set to five minutes. I've also set the colors to green and red and made it nice and bright, as this will be our entry signal. Now for the second Heiken Ashi indicator, I have set the time frame to the one hour chart. This way we can see what is going on on a higher time frame with trend, and it will maximize our success rate when taking trades on the five minute chart. And then on the colors, I've just changed the opacity to around 50%. So as we can see right here, this red line indicates that the New York session has now started, so we can start looking for entries. Currently the green Heiken Ashi is above the white, which means we're in an uptrend, but we will not be taking trades as our entry trigger has not confirmed yet. And here we go, this is the first signal for our entry. Red Heiken Ashi indicator has obviously cleared the white Heiken Ashi, which is now directly behind and the red has surpassed below it. This now means that we can look to enter our trade. Set your entry at the candle close. Now there is a couple places that you can put your stop loss. You can put it at the Heiken Ashi level. You can put it at a fixed rate above or below price. Or for a sell in this example, you can put it at a recent swing high. 
Now for the take profit, we do not set a take profit. We let these trades trail every single time. And I'm gonna show you exactly why. The first option for X in your trade is to wait for price to close above the Heiken Ashi indicator. This would be on the high of this candle right here and this trade would have netted us a 3.7 risk to reward ratio. And the second strategy is to wait until the Heiken Ashi indicators have both crossed again. This is a nice way to catch them really, really long trends. In this case, we were a couple of points shorter than the previous option, but over long term, I do believe that waiting for the recross of both of the Heiken Ashi candles is the best way to exit your trade. Now there is one negative to this strategy and that is it's pretty common to have trades enter late. Sometimes it can take quite a while for the Heiken Ashi indicators to cross. Price has already started to move in the direction that it wants to go. But as you can see here, they have both crossed. So again, we would enter our sell at the close of this candle. Set our stop loss at the recent swing right here and then leave the take profit open and see what happens. Another rule for trades like this is to not close out your trade. If the Heiken Ashi indicators cross and price is inside the negative stop loss area. So if your trade is floating inside the negative risk to reward area and the Heiken Ashi indicators cross, do not exit your trade. These trades will either hit stop loss or we will exit manually when in a profit. We do not exit the trades when they are in a negative position. And this is a great example of why we do not do that. Because if we had have exited during the negative, then we would have missed out on all these points down here. And there we go, that trade made a 1.3 risk to reward ratio. Okay, it is time to test this strategy 100 times. And if you've made it this far into the video, I do really appreciate it. I don't know if you can tell, but I do have a cold at the minute as it is that time of year, but the show must go on. So let's show you those results. And here are the results. And as you can see, we had a huge, huge 215% profit increase on the account. We started the account at a nice $100 and took it all the way up to $315 with a 58% win rate across 100 trades. The most consistent wins was five trades in a row and the most consistent losses is four with two trades going negative at the beginning for a very small amount before the nice steady climb up. But 58 wins and 42 losses isn't too bad considering this strategy is super easy to use and it doesn't require too much time during the day at all. But I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you want to see better profits than this, then click one of these two videos right here. And again, thank you very much for all the love on the channel recently. I really do appreciate it. But let's get every single one of you trading in 2024.